So, coming this Saturday, I'm going to go to roof shooting. I'm going to go out early morning, in fact, and start off there with some decoys and try this out. Lovely guns. This is my, my usual over and under, the uh, Roku 6000 top grade. It's a lovely gun. I've had this for, for over 30 years now. Hand carved the um, stock myself here to make the ducks on that side and, uh, and some geese on that side. Rather nice and uh, well used to that, but I do like and I love the old Damascus barrels. And, uh, and this particular gun, although it's side by side, it's the same length of stock. We've got the beautiful Damascus pattern barrels on there, which you can probably just see on there the rose pattern. And uh, it's just lovely to feel something when you're out there to have something so traditional in the woodland. So I had an old hammer gun, as you may remember from my other shooting, and I had a 30-inch barrel of Damascus before. This is a 27-inch ejecting gun, which is rather nice. And this fits me nicely, so we'll see how it goes on Saturday. I'll have a day with that. There's a good girl. Ready for another do, aren't we? So we're going to go down to the wood at Tetford here, the whole shoe wood. Something we've come to the last five or six years and really enjoyed. And we'll have a lovely time, won't we, Doc? We hope. It's a bit still, a bit bright. There's a good girl. Ready for another do, aren't we? So we're going to go down to Little Wood at Tetford here, the whole shoe wood. Something we've come to the last five or six years and really enjoyed. And we'll have a lovely time, won't we, Doc? We hope. It's a bit still, a bit bright. We will see something. This is just flying around here. Beautiful place. A little bit high up these ones. Too high. Just look at them all though. That one's down. Good dog. A few about, just getting them low enough. Down, go fetch, go fetch. If we stand just up in here, a good spot. Yes, I should put to see everything from here. Come on, good girl. Good dog. Good girl, come on, let's go, dog drop. Will he come down? Is the point? That's a nice 
that's one good Come on then. There's a good girl. Drop. That's a good dog. decoys out. I think we'll just put a few decoys out on this stubble just in case that it interests the birds. birds out again. Two, two birds down the one shot's gotta be good. I'll put these just up here with the other. And one down here as well. Well we've been here about half an hour and we've got six birds down already and a couple have just weaned off but we haven't missed many. I've put some decoys just out here just in case, which might help them come into the trees over us. So far then, six birds or eight cartridges. Not too bad. Not quite. A bit too high up. Anything back round again maybe? Coming down to the decoys, almost. Coming round my decoys, look. Can't quite see him at the moment. Here he comes. No, I couldn't quite get at him. Put it. We didn't go for that one, did we? Good dog, come on. I'll just toss through there, but I can't quite get at it. Don't think. No. Go fetch. There's a good girl. Yeah, that's a good dog, is it? Gotta come down a minute. There's another one in the bag, so seven up there and two in the bag. Well, it's quarter past three, so had an hour. We've got eight birds, that's not bad going. It's such a beautiful place, this horseshoe wood. You can see the horseshoe going around there. We shot it earlier this season, you had a bit of video on that. It's a fantastic shoot, this one, with really high birds coming through. It's just so lovely to come here, we're shooting every year, being invited. Last four or five years now, which has been wonderful. One way up there, but I don't quite get at him. Is he going to come round or not? I think a circle round. Not going to come in yet, I don't think. Oh, I don't know who comes. Well, I'm glad we got that one after all then. That's good. There's a good girl. Come on. That's a good dog. Drop, yep. Oh, it's a long shot and she's found that right down in the field. Good dog. Good girl. Come on then. There's a good dog. What a clever girl, aren't you? Come on then. That's Put that one away in here. bird coming through here. He's down nicely. Go fetch him. Good dog. But he's got a 
shooting over there now. I think with the sun as it is, we're going to need to change positions, dog, because the sun's smacking my eyes now. So I'm going to need to get behind a tree somewhere. Let's see if this spot's any better. I've got the sun behind a tree there. You can at least see. Where's he going? Down the bottom of those trees. You'll pick him up for me. Yeah, yeah. Come on, fish it here. Good dog. Last one. Good girl drop. There's a good dog. Last 12, 13 birds in there. She's a good girl, aren't you? Yes. Doxy. Well, I reckon the evening's almost finished, don't you, dog? We'll stay another 10 minutes or so. Just watch the sunset. What do you see? He's a good girl. Well, I seem to be about it, quarter past five, and I think we're about done, aren't we, dog? Mm. Beautiful place to be, had a lovely evening. Come on then, time to go. Here we are at the woods at dawn. A bit touch of it again. Horseshoe wood. To spend the whole day this time. And a decoy first through. And then roost shoot into the evening. So here we are then. And I reckon that we can set in just here. So we'll set up just here with the poles. Well, there we are. Got the hide set up break up the shape we put some bits of maize around. Dog's ready. We're going to put the decoys out here now. Well I've set myself up a nice pattern but there's so much wildlife. Look at these deer here just running away over the field. So we're early morning we got here just after half past five so I'm here for the dawn. Normally would be pigeons here but to say we've obviously been clearing out the woodland and burning stuff so I just hope the birds haven't been put off too much. So I put up ten rockers and the floater at the moment, I've got another bar ready with a floater to put a real bird on and I've just lofted up a couple of birds in the tree and the hide I'm using is stealth netting a bit of maze around the front just to break it up a bit dog watching for rabbits inside, nicely set up with a swivelling seat cartridge bag ready to put any dead cartridges in or birds if we need to and I've got my two guns here because I want to try out this new side by side to be rather fun. So just in case the cyber side isn't what I hope it'll be, or shooting as well, I'm going to have both the guns there. The side by side is improved in quarter and the over and under is quarter and a half so it's slightly longer range. But from here we should be able to see everything we need out there and hopefully we'll get something in. We're set up then. Well, here we are set up at seven, and there's not one pigeon in sight as yet because of the work I think that's been going on here the last few days. The crow's coming over there, but not coming in this way. That's one down. Go fetch. I use the over and under for that one. Nice shot though. Please with that. Not with the new gun. Now we'll set this bird up on here. Seems a bit mean, but that's the way it's got to be. And there we are. We've got our floater ready. Well, it's just coming up to nine o'clock. We haven't had much luck. We had one bird down with the other gun and a quick shot at one in the tree here, which is rather far away. So I think uh, we'll put the camera away now and just keep the GoPro out. Well, we just had a couple come up in a Land Rover, a four-wheel drive, and they explained to me that, as I thought, somebody had been here three or four days ago and shot 40-odd. So they spoiled it for me today, I'm afraid. Might as well go and we'll try and shoot somewhere else, maybe over at Summercoats.
fridge. Good dog. Drop the girl. Way up there, a bit too high. At least we've got run down with this gun, even though it wasn't a hard bird. Must be hit. Go fetch. Good dog, hop. Good girl, I'll drop the dog. Good girl, hop. Hop you come, hop. Here you come, hop. Good girl. Drop the dog. Put these away. Just tidy up. Put the cartridges away as well. Go fetch. That one's down in the bushes. Oh. Get the one myself. The dog's gone for the minute. Good girl, you've got the other one, that was a very tall one. There's a good dog, so we've got the two of them now then. Excellent. Come here, come here. Bring it here, because a good girl, come on. That's a couple of pleasing shots with this new gun, isn't it, dog? Pitch. Good girl, drop it. Fitch. Hop, hop, get over, hop. Good dog, come on. Good girl. Good dog, we'll make up for here, what me instead, hmm? Yep. Not quite. Go fetch. Good dog. Sit down. Sit. Sit down. Good girl. Drop. Good girl. Come on. Good dog. Go fetch. Good dog drop. Ten. I guess it's almost time to put the things away. We'll just tidy up in case we get one or two last birds. Mr. 
There we go, that was surprising. Didn't come down, had two shots at it. So that was. must have been hit. Go fetch. That probably is the last one of the evening. Good dog, come on then. Makes number 11. They were shooting about two to one. It's just swinging around here. Right high overhead, see if any of them come down low enough to come in. They're looking at me. A little bit high. I think that's it, so we'll get going now. It's starting to get dark, we'll just go back to where we started off. Well, Good. that's it then. We managed to rescue a spoiled deer, haven't we, dog? But uh, that's what happens sometimes. Several people shoot the same ground, but we've managed to get 11 tonight, which is still good. Here you go, up. Now I go home, get the dog some food, get this all sorted out. Hey, that's a good girl, eh? Go fetch.